Join us in building a more fair and transparent future. Visit ParticiaBlockchain.com today. Welcome to Decrypt, the series that decodes and demystifies everything blockchain, crypto finance, and cybersecurity. Today, we're going to talk about Europe's largest blockchain conference that I hold close to my heart because it's hosted right here in my hometown of Paris, France, and also because of its educational and inclusive nature. Paris Blockchain Week welcomes people from around the world to learn more about blockchain, NFTs, and crypto and is held in venues steeped in French history and culture like the historic Paris Stock Exchange in 2022. Emmanuel Finet, the CEO of this prestigious conference, is here with us to give us a preview of what to expect next March and also to share a scoop with us. Welcome, Emmanuel. Thanks for having me. Hi, Jim. Emmanuel, I would like you to explain to us the success around Paris Blockchain Week, which is now regarded as one of the top three crypto conferences in the world. Oh, well, thanks for saying that. Um, there are several reasons for that. One of them is that we are um, a pioneer conference. Uh, it's already the fourth edition. Um, another reason is it's been uh, it's been founded by people that are really le legitimate in the in the blockchain industry. Another reason, of course, is Paris. It's not just a great city for a, an international event, uh, but it's also a, a, a blockchain ecosystem. The, the government has been wise enough uh, to create the condition for um, startups and, and tech companies to uh, to blossom. And we've had in the blockchain uh, sector uh, a few unicorns uh, like uh, Ledger, like uh, Soraya, uh, like Tezos, um, and not only um, startups but also uh, industry leaders that are now coming uh, to Paris, like Binance, who's uh, recently invested a lot of uh, a lot of resource and they established themselves in in Paris. And why do you call it Paris Blockchain Week instead of some of the other crypto conferences, which are being called like Paris uh, Crypto Week, for example? Blockchain it is the actual um, uh, technology which supports all the innovation that we are talking about, and we respect uh, this industry enough to 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 remain a blockchain event. Um, and uh, uh, if we were to call it crypto, in the general public um, opinion, crypto is still very much associated with cryptocurrencies, uh, but we cover much more than this uh, at, the, at the event. So that's why it's Paris Blockchain Week. So we are going through still a crypto winter since April 2022. Mm. What are your expectations for the next conference and are you taking a bit of a risk here? We are certainly not uh, not taking a risk. Um, a bear market is the time for uh, people really to think over the business model, about the, the, the wealth that we are creating, uh, about the next innovations and technology. Uh, so this is the right time for builders. And we are not just a conference uh, um, for, for, for a boom market, um, but we are also a conference uh, for, for building the next Web3. Emmanuel, okay. you came today because you wanted to share a scoop with us. Go for it. Uh, so I'm very pleased to announce that we're going to host next uh, year's edition in uh, the Louvre. Uh, so it's uh, the, the biggest museum in the world and it's a, a great landmark uh, um, building in Paris, uh, but it's also the home to um, all the arts, um, the art collection, the sculpture collection, the painting. And what we are going to need for uh, building the next Web3 is really a creator's economy and a lot of creativity. And uh, we think that's the right message to send uh, for, uh, for a blockchain event and the Web3 event. Can you share with us now your pitch to get different types of publics to attend Paris Blockchain Week in March? We are covering the whole range of, of Web3 topics, uh, NFT, Metaverse, uh, Blockchain, and in Blockchain we cover um, decentralized finance, we cover uh, government and, um, and regulation, we cover the, all the technology update, we see how the, the companies can be onboarded um, into uh, into the industry and and, and uh, into uh, these new technologies, uh, but we're also uh, having new features. This year we're going to have a, a, an investor event uh, because the companies uh, still need to be found and uh, and funded to uh, to build the new business models and technologies. Uh, we're going to have a talent fair as well uh, for uh, the jobs that uh, need to be created, the ones that are already there, but the ones that still need to be invented uh, so that we can have a, a successful uh, new world of Web3. And of course, all the side events and the art exhibitions um, and, and, and creative events that we, we, we all, always have during this event. Sounds exciting in Emmanuel and I will be there with you. See you in March in the Louvre. And thank you for decrypting why blockchain and crypto conferences are a good use of your time and see you next week when we will talk to the world's number one crypto hard wallet and why this is important for all of us. Thanks for watching i24 news audience. Bye. Partizia blockchain infrastructure for the greater good.